Well, the Canadian Skyhawks team is on the island right now for Operation Pegasus, which we showed you earlier tonight. But this is hardly the first time they've been here. And tonight on Island Rewind, we're going back to the year 2003 when reporter Murray Langdon, seen there, got to fly high with the Skyhawks. A very small percentage of the population will ever jump out of an airplane. An even smaller percentage actually do it for a living. I thought of this as I found myself strapped to one such person, preparing to plunge more than 3,000 meters to Earth at a speed of 200 kilometers an hour. I also had second thoughts about signing the liability waiver an hour before. The man I'm tethered to is part of the Skyhawks, the Canadian Forces Parachute Team, which will be performing at this weekend's Comox Air Show. The team is composed of 17 members and travels throughout the summer season uh, and does parachuting demonstrations. With the help of aircrew from 442 Squadron, the team performs 80 shows in 45 locations a year all over the world. But the team's captain says the squad's role isn't limited to just performing. In the course of a season, we will uh, de do demonstrations in front of anywhere in between a million and two million uh, people. The Skyhawks is also a little bit of an instrument to uh, attract potential uh, recruits. What we do in the air is called uh, parabatics, parachute acrobatics. So we get a couple parachutes together and, and do formations. We get three parachutes together, one on top of the other. It's complex and requires skill. And the best place to see what's involved is in the air. First, we gear up. Then, it's time for some coaching. The excitement and anticipation is overwhelming as we head to the Buffalo aircraft that will send us soaring. Look good, feel good. It takes a little coaxing to get on the plane, but before you know it, we hit the skies. I try to keep cool as the departure door is opened. I'm helped with the wind whipping by at breakneck speed. Of course, I try not to think of breaking necks, but before I can panic, we get the go-ahead, and the experience of a lifetime is underway. Ready? Yeah. Together, myself and Sergeant Kevin Karambowicz fall to earth in tandem, turning and twisting. We get just over half a minute of free fall at 200 kilometers per hour before the chute is pulled. Carefully, we navigate our way back down to earth. And gently, we touch down. Oh, what a rush. Free to go. What a <laughs> All right. The ride is over, but the memories will last forever. A thrill for sure, but made easy thanks to the Skyhawks. I'll never look at life the same way again. <laughs> Island Rewind is brought to you by Arbutus RV. Whatever your adventure, six island locations to serve you. Nice work, Murray. That's going to do it for us here on Check News at 6. Andy Neal is up next to Check News at 10. And we're going to leave you tonight with my jump with the Skyhawks in 2019, which I'm still very much buzzing from. Thanks for joining us.